politics, entertainment stories, current affairs, and exclusive interviews. Welcome. Welcome. Welcome on The Buzz UG with, with Melads Mino, Mino, a.k.a. Fuller. Now, Bobby Wine's Camp National Unity Platform has announced that they'll be backing the Honorable Ali Salaso from General Mugisha Mutu's Camp ANT in the upcoming Serere by election. We are going to Serere as a national unity platform to support the Honorable Ali Salaso, who is uh, the flag bearer of Alliance for National Transformation ANT. Well, NUP says this is aimed at strengthening the united forces of change, which the withdrawn candidate considered to. We don't just want to participate in this uh, election. Uh, just for the sake of it, we want to have results from this election. The Honorable Ali Salaso will win uh, with the support of the rest of us among the forces of change. It is the right thing to do. To my supporters in Serere, we've decided that we are all going to rally behind Alaso. We have accepted here today that we are going to support Honorable Alice Alaso Ashanut. Now, the pronouncement has been welcomed with mixed reactions from political analyst Professor Sabit Makara from Makere University and Yusuf Serunguma, with one saying it's the way to go, while another saying a united opposition is of no value. Now that uh, Noob has decided to support uh, Alice Alaso, who is a veteran politician in that area, I think it is good for the opposition. Uh, our parliamentary politics is very valueless. There's no value in being an MP. There's no value that comes to the people you represent. Whereas NUP and uh, ANT have chosen to speak with a common voice in the Serere by election, FDC, through their deputy spokesperson, John Kikonyogo, have said they will keep in the race with their own flag bearer. As FDC, we are founded to participate in elections. So we feel that the candidate, anything else can be discussed between parties. Nobody has approached FDC up to today to discuss whether we should have a joint candidate or not. Now, Makara also said FDC keeping defiant on supporting a single candidate is placing the opposition at a risk of falling prey to the NRM victory. That FDC holding out, uh, doing the same mistake like they, like they did in Kasese, which will obviously give an advantage to the NRM candidate in Serere. The contention is not over whether we represent a similar position. The contention is not whether when we stand together we can push a particular position, right? The contention is, how do I get there? And in many moments, they find themselves divided on who has to go there. And you know that's a, an FDC stronghold. Anybody should pull out to FDC, not the other way around. If we are to be serious and you look at the statistics on the ground. Now, NUP has also announced intentions to go to court and file for habeas corpus for John Bosco Chibalama, whom the Prime Minister Robin Nabanja confirmed that he's in their custody. They have been denying Chibalama all the while. Now, Nabanja has come out to clarify that they have him. We shall go back to court again to apply for habeas corpus. NUP has also trashed the allegations by the Attorney General that the party doesn't disclose the details of the abductees, saying they have continued to engage all the security agencies whenever their members are abducted. Well, there you go. Uh, that is the latest update I got for you right now on uh, the Buzz UG. Uh, in case you have anything on your mind about this story, uh, just put it down in the comment section. But uh, most importantly, make sure that you subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Remember, I have always promised you that I'll keep you posted on everything that is happening in the country. Yeah, so you don't have to worry about anything. My name is Melad Milo, aka Fula, and it's a bye for now. Thank you. Audio Jungle.